Here's a quick demo on how to use inner app audio between Geo Shred and GarageBand. Okay, I've got an iPad Pro over here, but it doesn't matter which device you have. So I had Geo Shred up. Now I'm going to look for GarageBand. So I'm starting up GarageBand. And what you want to do is essentially you want to go to My Songs. And you want to add another one to create a new song. And you use this audio recorder thing. Okay. Then over here you want to hit on this button. Over here, which is a little weird, but... And then you want section A to be automatic so it doesn't moronically stop on you. If you want to count in, you could put that metronome. I don't care about the metronome, so I'm going to take it off. Now I go to this inner app audio uh, thing over here. It looks like a little plug of some kind. I click on that. I go inner app audio. I pick the instrument to be Geo Shred. Then I click on the Geo Shred icon, and now you see these controls come up in Geo Shred. That's that's red there, even though it's it's real. There it is. Now you can see it's red. Okay, so all I got to do is click on this red button, and for whatever reason, GarageBand still give me the count in. I just do my thing in Geo Shred. I come here and I stop. I rewind it. I have to play it. Okay, let's try that again. Pause it. I'm gonna rewind it. Now I'm gonna go to back to GarageBand. All I gotta do is just hit on the GarageBand icon to do that. Can I see the GarageBand icon? Yeah, there it is. There it is. Now I'm back in GarageBand and I can play this what I just did. Cool. So now I want to get this off my device, right? So I could go to my songs again, and then that's just the one I did. And let's see, there is a way to get this out of here. I go back to this thing maybe. Oh no, I know. I go back here, then I select it. Ah. I go to my songs. This is really weird. Then you go select. You hit that thing, then you hit the share button. And then you got multiple ways of sharing it. The best way to do it is to have the iPad connected to your device and then share with, I think with iTunes. Uh, see, cause you don't want to do it to SoundCloud. That will, um, that will essentially, oh, the iTunes, there it is. The iTunes icon's right there. So essentially send song four to iTunes as a um, as a stereo file. Okay, and then it's gonna give you some things here and I hit share and now it's gonna save it to iTunes. Now, when I go over the Mac, if I look in iTunes, you know, and I basically go back to here and let's see, I, got, I think I go to apps, my iPad apps. No, I have to go to the device. There's the device. So I got the tab for my device. And then I got the apps tab on the device. Now it's gonna it should show the apps that are on the device. And for what oh, there they are. I click GeoShred. No, I click GarageBand, and then it's gonna take that song that I just did there. And what time is it now? It's about yeah, this one right here. This is it. So basically, I select that thing. Okay, I'm selecting that song, my song four, from GarageBand. And now I'm going to hit this Save To button. And I'm going to stick it on the desktop. Just on my desktop there and hit Save To. And if I go back to the desktop, it will... Um, there we go. It'll give me my file and I'll just, I'll just open it with Audacity or something. And that's the file I had in GeoShred. So there, that's how you do it.